Okay, so the first thing you're going to need to do is connect to your camera's Wi-Fi. Uh, I'm just selecting the image app on the, the camera itself just to start the Wi-Fi and tell it to uh, allow a connection from the phone. Give it a few seconds to start. You can see the uh, TZ60 is listed in the wireless list. So we'll just connect to it there. There we go. Connected. <coughs> can ignore that because we don't have internet access via the camera. Um, so then we need to just start the intervalometer app. There we go. So IP address of the device is shown. The IP address of the camera there um, happens to be right this time. Uh, you'll normally find it ends with a dot one um, and is more or less the same as the address you had. So just set the number of frames you want. Set the number of seconds between the frames. Don't go too short on lower powered cameras because uh, they take a few seconds to take the shots. You just get a little uh, line there telling you how long your overall video will be. So we'll change that. And then just uh, hit the test button if you actually want to test connectivity to the camera. It'll uh, just send the camera a couple commands, see if it's responding. Uh, and when you're ready, just click go. Um, you do get a warning that the lens will extend. That's just to uh, make sure you don't have anything up against the lens because it'll go into record mode. You might have heard the camera extend the lens there. And uh, off we go. A uh, little progress bar down here will give you a rundown of where we are. And you should hear the camera taking some images. There we go. Anytime you want to actually stop the process, just hit the stop button. That'll end it there and then. And um, all the images will be stored in the camera. Uh, hope you found that useful.